My name is Romero, and yes, I am that guy with the vegan neck tattoo. Let's move on. The truth. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I'm going to be showing you how to make homemade peppermint ice cream. With that said, let's get started with some ice cream. The first thing that you want to do is open your freezer and you should have a big old tub of frozen bananas. You don't need any parchment paper or anything like that. You can just put them in there each individually. It makes it a whole lot easier to just peel them and drop them in there. Next, you're going to want to take about three bananas. You can break them up with your bare hands and plop them right in there. Cutting them up like this makes it easier for the blade of your food processor to be able to take care of it all and make it all fit. That looks like a pretty good amount of bananas. I think we're done with that part. Next thing we're going to do is go into the fridge. You have two options here. You can either use a little bit of bottled water or if you want creamier ice cream you can use this protein milk from silk almonds and cashews 10 grams of protein per cup pour a good amount about that should be good next step in this holiday recipe is to add some of the organic Peppermint extract. Go ahead and put a good amount in there. About one eighth the bottle. I'm gonna go ahead and add some Now Sports MCT oil. It's good for weight management. And bonus, it's got a vanilla hazelnut flavor, which will work for our holiday recipe. Get a little bit of that. Last but not least is to get a little bit of protein. I'm using Vega made with real plant-based food ingredients, vanilla flavored. That should do. You're gonna wanna be very careful. Put it in any cracks or crannies that you can see, and boom. Final step, mix that bad boy. Now after all of that, your banana ice cream should be good to go. Take your lid off. Look, look how creamy that looks. And you just fill your bowl up with all that ice creamy goodness. It's got a bit of a soft serve consistency. You can add any kind of toppings you want to your ice cream like pumpkin pie spice, organic hemp seeds, whole almonds, and that's how you make banana ice cream. Very simple, very easy to make. It definitely tastes like peppermint. This is a pretty good holiday treat. This was my first time using uh, peppermint oil in my banana ice cream. I've used protein shakes, I've used peanut butter, I've used many different ingredients, but well, it's the holidays. I wanted to do a holiday recipe and this came out really good. Well, that's all for today. Thank you for stopping by and watching the video. If you like my channel, please like, subscribe, hit the bell, and I'll see you around, guys. Bye. Uh.